Hi everybody, this is Rhys Marber from Audiology Associates. Thanks for watching our short video on middle ear fluid today. Uh, so we're talking about the middle ear space. Now it's really important that we keep this space nice and clean and free from infection. So the way we do that is we produce a fluid in this space uh, called middle ear fluid and that gets drained down the eustachian tube, taking any bugs and bacteria that are trying to enter the middle ear space from high up in the, in the throat there. So it gets washed down with the fluid and then we swallow that away without even realizing we're doing it into the stomach which kills the bacteria. Now what can happen if we get um, sort of any sort of condition Congestion at the back of the nose there, it can actually cause the eustachian tube to shut and then the fluid can't get out so it starts to back up in the system. Now this causes a mild hearing loss and patients would describe a little bit of popping and crackling as this starts to clear. In most cases this will clear itself in about six weeks time uh, and drain away on its own and then the hearing will return back to normal. Now in long-standing issues this can be called middle ear effusion and this can cause a few other issues but in most cases it resolves quite quickly. Thank you for watching this guys and as always take care.